hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel or if you're new hello my name's donna thank you very much for tuning in to my video this is a complete mixed bag haul i have bits from a car boot sale i have bits from charity shop i have bits from Superdrug. i think there might be something in there from matalan um and also the factory shop so it is a complete mixed bag it is everything i bought last weekend um i went out and about we did a car boot sale then we popped into town and yeah these are just all the little bits that i bought so i am gonna show you what i got um so yeah first item bargain these were um, if these were my daughter's size, she would have been over the moon. My daughter really likes Puma. Um, and yeah, my partner found these at the car boot sale. Um, as you can see, they've hot, they have been worn, but they've, you know, they're not showing, um, as in they're not worn out. Um, the tread is still 100% completely there. Um, they're my size, size seven, soft foam optimal comfort i'm gonna try them on i have no trousers on but i just want to see if they're mm. yeah they are actually comfortable um so yeah i'm tough with that a pound if I was selling these at a car boot sale, I would have been asking like five pound. And even that, I would have said was cheap. <clears throat> but yeah. So he did good with them. Awesome. Right. Let's just find all my car boot bits. This I got from a car boot sale. Still got its tag on from New Look. Um, this is last summer's range, so not the summer that's just gone, but the one before that. Um, because I think I might have bought it, but in my size, because they do small, medium, large, and possibly an extra large. And I bought it in the large, and it was, it was like a tent. So it ended up going back. I saw this. This is a size small, and look how big that is. So, I'm going to try this on. So, um, yeah, size small. I paid a pound for this, by the way. I don't know what the price should have been, £12.99. I know caftans are supposed to be oversized, but... I think I could still get away with this. I don't know, what do we think? Can I get away with it or is it, can you tell it is? Too small. But yeah, I paid a pound for it. Um, okay, that's charity shop. I know that for definite. That was a charity shop. Pretty sure that was you could right. This one's car boot. So this dress is papaya papaya is that matalan yes matalan um so yeah just like an autumn autumnal sort of dress um let's try it on it's a size 14 so i'm a 16 <laughs>
like in the wind you know like when it's really really cold thick tights boots yeah i like this um and again probably a pound for this at the car boot sale um so yeah like this that's another car booter but well, i'm just working out what's car boot what's charity shop that's charity shop Oh, that's car boot. I think that's it. Okay, so I've got two more charity, sh uh, two more car boot sales, and then it is charity shop. Um, again, this was a pound. This is Jane Norman. It is in a size. I do believe it's actually in my size. It is a size 16. But Jane Norman normally come up small. Yeah, it's a 16. So I don't have much hope. But it was only a pound, so I thought I'd try it. So here we go. Next one. But I do like this dress. So yeah, that's good. This is gonna be too tight, I can tell already. I just like this bit. I thought this bit was quite sweet. I just love, yeah. But yeah, it is a bit snug. Mm. Right. Last item from the car boot sale, and it's this one. It is a new look top, but it is in a size 18. It was a pound, so let's try it. But yeah, I'm a bit, gut yeah, no, I'm just not confident enough because of all this. So this is a no. So that one is in the no pile. Let's try this. Love. Yes. Love this top. I love a top you can wear. I always try to give it that little bit more of a pull. But yeah, I love an off-the-shoulder top. I don't know if it's supposed to be off the shoulder or if it's just supposed to be a wide. But, yeah, I would wear it off the shoulder. Not bad for a pound. Yep, yeah, like, right. Three items from a charity shop. First item is, right. <laughs> I wasn't sure on how I would wear this because it's um it's like not long enough to be a dress so it's a bit like a tunic so this came from the Cornwall Air Ambulance I paid £3.50 so yeah 
I don't know what I'd wear it with. Jeans, maybe? I don't actually have any jeans down here, but um, let's try it on. But this green one is a keeper. That's not bad. Three items from the... Hang on. One, two, three... I've bought four items of clothes from the car boot sale. Only one's no good. So that's not bad. Three out of four. Not bad. And my partner got the shoes and they're perfect. So, let's try this one on. This is a weird name. App Appenage? I don't know. Oh, wow. That is... Yeah, that is... Super duper booby. No, no, I would 100% have to wear something under that. So, no, that one is no good. Oh. Uh, Right, now this is my size, so they say it is a cup she dress and it is in, that says size medium. Where did I see the tag? Yeah, 1XL, which I'm assuming should be a 16 to 18 for a 1X. But it's brand new with tags. So this is on the sale rail in the charity shop. So it was $5.99. And then it was in the sale rail for $1.99. Um, and the fact it's still got its tags, cider tags. So uh, I just thought, you know what? I'm gonna try it for $1.99. It's a cow neck. Just a bit. Oh, the straps feel a bit feel a bit weird. They feel a bit far apart. Right, but anyway, so this is the dress. It fits. But yeah. I'm not over keen on how I look in it. But maybe with a pair of tights and a pair of boots, maybe. I don't know. See what it looks like from the back. Lovely material. It just is very, okay, what have we got left? Yeah, I don't know, I'll ponder this one. Ponder it. Right, so last charity shop top this is where are you from soon i don't know what brand that is size 16 three pound 50 This is it done up. Right. I was thinking with a pair of, well, you could wear blue jeans, black jeans. 
Yeah, I quite like this. It's comfy. I think. Yeah. Okay. So that's card boot sale and charity shop done. Then I went to. Oh, I popped into Superdrug. And. I just want to show um I've got my daughter two um necklaces I've been after sterling silver necklaces and I really like this the bloody price has gone it was 10 pound for this sterling silver necklace but on their jewelry in there it's buy one get one half price so I actually found her another sterling silver necklace um, with a heart and she's had that one already um, so yeah I gave in and I gave her that one um, but yeah so I've got the two necklaces for 15 quid so that's not bad for two silver necklaces um, so yeah so that one is a little bumblebee um, and she's got the heart and then when I was looking I noticed that all of their misguided makeup was all down to 50p now they had so much foundation there but i didn't pick any up because it was all the dark skin tone foundations which is obviously you know it's the end of their stuff so um i picked up a couple items for a few items for 50p so sugar coat misguided this is cream to powder pigment eyeshadow so this one's in let's toast and that is the shade of it Um, I don't want to open it because I don't know if I'm going to keep it for me or if I'll give it to my daughter. I don't know. So I'm not going to open that one. And then there's this one, Lip Juice, Super Shine, Super Shine Lip Gloss. Um, so there's this one. So again, 50p. Um, and this is in Hot Sauce. So I don't know if that would be too red for her. I don't know. But 50p. Um, and then I got myself two lipsticks. So, um, Spill the Tea is that shade. I do love the packaging. Um, and then I got this one. Um, is this one? No, see, they are all sealed up. So I made sure I went for. Is it sealed up? Yeah. Um, and this one I've got in power, a real dark. So I've gone for a, a light brown and then a dark brown. So, uh, but yeah, for 50p each. Oh, I love a bargain. Um, so the, yeah, gimme lips. So one's matte. So the really dark one, the power one, that's a matte. Um, but yeah, they were 50p each. So that's pretty damn awesome. Right, and then last shop was the factory shop. Um, I've got this t-shirt for my daughter. She likes um, she likes champion, she likes sports sort of t-shirts. Um, and she likes wearing men's slightly baggy t-shirts. So this is an immense, is it men's small? Yeah, that is good. Is it? Champion written logo t-shirt. Anyway, it should have been 12 quid and I got it for seven. But I just thought it's a nice size. That will fit her how she wants it to fit her. She likes oversized tees. She's got the, the you know, she's got the cropped ones and the ones that are fitted. But for when she's wearing leggings and stuff, she likes hers oversized, so I bought her that one. So that is going back for Christmas. So that was £7, so yeah, good. Uh, I bought a top for myself. Um, don't know if I'm going to like it. We will try it on. It is a one size, supposed to fit most. Um, should have been £22. Then it went down to a fiver. And then when it went through the till, it went through at £2. 
Um, again, it's one of those sort of tops I think will look quite nice with um, leggings, is what I'm thinking. So let's have a look. Is it something I could wear with a pair of leggings? Now, bearing in mind, it is a one size that fits most. I'm going to it off. No. Hmm. It's really soft thin material but yeah I don't think I'd wear it I don't know it's quite sweet but right last two items I've got this one, Garnier, new Invisible Protect Glow, 30, Sun Factor 30, Vitamin E Watermelon, Invisible on all skin tones, clear formula, quick dry, water resistant. So this was £3, but I liked it because it's, oh, I never realised that. Can you see that? I don't know if it's going to. It's um there. It's two levels of liquid. But it's not really showing you. Um but yeah, I didn't realise that. But yeah, for three quid. Um and this top layer seems to have a bit of like a sheen to it. So um yeah. Bronzing look. But yeah, three quid. So I bought that for next summer. Right. This is what I'm excited to open. This is a W7 mystery box, 10 piece. They reckon the recommended retail price is £50. I paid £10. So this is what it looks like. Now, I always buy my daughter makeup for Christmas. So, I was thinking, one, it'd be good to do it on my channel. And two, if there's anything I don't like, oh, it's all in a bag. Let me, I don't want to look. I want it to be a surprise. Come on, come on, come on. Put the finger through. Okay. Oh, it's so exciting. I love a mystery. First item, W7 Absolutely Prime Lash Primer. Didn't even know you could get a lash primer. Absolutely awesome, a lash masterpiece, a great performance. Prep and prime those lashes with bristles designed to separate each individual eyelash. Absolutely prime, reduces the risk of any clumping, meaning your favorite mascara can be applied with ease with an enhanced result. Okay, I didn't even know that was a thing. That is our first item. Tubit, what are you? Coats and defines lashes, flake free, intense length and curl, easy removal, easy removal, and it's black is black. Mascara. Always handy. She is literally just nicked the only mascara that I've got that I haven't even used yet. Um, I had a mascara in my makeup set and she's taken it. So, mascara. That's two. I eye Captain Liquid Eyeliner. I can't stand liquid eyeliner. Um, I make such a mess. I'm a pencil all the way um but yeah i'm very black so that is number three what are you coconut ice 
just want to see what it says. Oh, it's a lipstick. That's lovely. So it's a lipstick. I'm not opening it, as I say, because most of this will probably go to my daughter um, as part, you know, in her Christmas stuff. Oh, it's another lipstick. Is this another lipstick? I can't read it. The writing's so small. Yeah, another lipstick. And this one is in lollipop so that's the two so one is a light pink but with glitter and then yeah where are we at five so we're halfway iridescent lip topper there's another one yeah i definitely get my money's worth Oh, they're nice. Yeah, I think she'll like them. Nails. So they're like dark purple with the silver design. Well, we're on one, two, three, four, five, six. That's seven. Is there three more in here? Oh, yeah. Yeah, there is. What are you? Lip twister. So it's a lip liner. Whether or not you could use that with one of the um, with the lipsticks, I don't know. Possibly the, that one there. But yeah. Two items left. Power Petal, five mini makeup sponges. <gasps> awesome. Yeah, these are the sort of things that my daughter loves. These are ideal for under the eye area um, and around the nose. These are absolutely tiny. Oh my God. I don't think I've ever seen any here so small. Oh, and they feel amazing. Awesome. She will love. They are awesome. So that is that. And then last item. Come on. Last item. Moon Glade Eyeshadow Palette. Please don't be broke. Please don't be broke. Oh, that's nice. Oh, look. That was amazing value for 10 quid. Amazing. So yes. One, two, three. Try and get it all back in. Three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Yeah, that was an awesome buy. I'm very chuffed with that. Oh, stick. Um, I've just had a notification come through shortly ago to say that my Holland and Barrett advent calendar is going to be here today. Woohoo! Um, my favourite advent calendar. And it's pretty damn awesome because my sister loves a lot of um, toiletries that are all natural. She has ever such sensitive skin. So a lot of the products she uses... Um, you know, all natural products. So if there's anything in the advent calendar that I won't use, but I know she will, I can just put it back as a Christmas present. 
Um, I did it the last time I bought one, actually. So, um, so yeah, looking forward to doing that one. So that will be possibly my next upload. But anyway, yeah, I really need to go. I need to have a shower, uh, put all of this away, and then I've got to go to work. So thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button down below if you're not subscribed already. And I will see you again very soon for another video. Thank you for watching, guys. Bye.